All right, my apologies. <clears throat> well, it's been a fu it's been a while. Welcome everybody. Of course, um, Tino's Bankai. Uh, I do apologize for the mad amount of chemicals over here for some reason. I was just cleaning my car here earlier today, and well, last night, and I forgot. So let me uh, do one quick thing before we uh, do anything else. Always. I was getting tape on that bad boy at some point. <clears throat> but anyways, welcome everybody to Miss Bankai, of course. Uh, we're here. Uh, we're going to be playing a new game today, new game series. We'll be playing um, not a new game series, but a revisiting, but we're playing the new version of it. it is DMC Devil May Cry. <clears throat> it's the, uh, it's like the new, it's not the newest, newest one, but it was like the one that nobody, I, I, it's not nobody likes, but nobody uh, like that Dante, that version of Dante, because that Dante version looks terrible, which I gotta admit, that kind of does, like, the short hair looks kind of stupid. But, <clears throat> but anyways, so, <clears throat> I'm, I'm all over Twitter today, well, I was on Twitter for a little bit, <clears throat> and, um, I wanted, to, I asked the question, well, I'm looking for custom character female names. So... So I went on, of course, and <clears throat> we sit there, and so I'm thinking about it, I'm like, well, <clears throat> I want to go with a name that has meaning to it, and, and it means the message, or something like that, you know? Just have, like, some sort of meaning. It doesn't have to have full meaning, but it has some meaning, you know? So, that's not really the point. So anyways, um, <clears throat> so I'll go on Final Fantasy fourteen today. Um, and we're just, I'm just kind of just talking to people. I put up a party finder. And a lot of the, uh, a lot of people asked, like, hey, can we get, like, an idea of what this character is? I'm like, okay. So I gave him the story. So it goes like this. So I'll, you know what? I'll put it into fucking great fucking detail. Um, <clears throat> so it'll be kind of hard to say. Um, <clears throat> so this is the point. Um, once upon a time, there was... Um, shit, I'm forgetting words today. Speaking of them and typing out two different things. Um, <clears throat> once upon a time, um, in older, in back, back in the past, way back, you know, in ancient history, a human, uh, discovers a dragon, an Isle of Dragons. <clears throat> and the Isle of Dragons that he discovers, he actually, ki he attempts, he actually does kidnap a, ba a dragon link, which, if you guys don't know, that's a baby dragon. <clears throat> So finally, the Dragon King final um, cursed him with the power of the negative dragon. Yes, I'm going with my own lore here, so it's gonna be hilarious. You guys can take it to however you want. Uh, this t and this takes place, of course, in the town. Oh, God damn it! I'm, my, my brain's like all the place today. So I tell him the story, right? Well, I'll, I'll, if anybody asks, that's fine. I'll, I'll definitely put more. Um, Bored and thought to it. But the whole point. So they gave me Rear, uh, Asha, or Ash for the names. So I was kind of like, Rear looks cool, but um, sorry, if you guys don't know how to spell that, um, give me uh, give me one second. We're gonna. There you go. Hold on. I'll tell you. I'll spell it out. Ear. So E I R. It just means like um mercy. Uh mercy. I guess you know. And I think it's in um. I don't know what kind of wording it was. It's um. I think it's. I think it's Greek. But I could be wrong. Oh. Oh, second. Sure So anyways, besides the point. So is, is, is ear, ash, or asha? And I was kind of like, well, let me look at more options. Maybe I'll combine words to mean something. <sighs> Maybe I could say like Ryu, um... Or the, the word for dragon and then like <clears throat> dragon healer maybe or something like that. 
whatever it could be that it could be a lot of things i could do with but the problem is well it depends on the arthur i'm like well there's a, there's a lot going on but i i gotten some pretty good like understanding a little bit but not entirely but a figure might be kind of fun uh. um so anyways so let me kind of just get to the point um All right, excuse me for that one. I did look for it for a second. Um, so that's not even why I wanted to go to that route, if you get what I mean. But anyways, besides the point, uh, we're going to try to uh, bang this out as much as possible. So I'm still looking at names right now, and we haven't really come up with really anything. I haven't come up with anything to kind of think about it, you know? Uh, but they're trying to understand is, well, what's the world building like? So I'm like, well... At first, I, I wasn't sure, but I just came up with something in my head. I, was like, I think it's more of like a modern world. So, what actually got me to think about really this for a long time, I was going to just chatting just for like maybe a few minutes, um, was um, the, the world behind the Bleach anime was probably something I really fucking enjoyed. With like, it's a modern world, but in a fantasy fucking setting behind it. Or folklore, or whatever you want to call it. I love that shit, so I wanted to take the con- not the con- entire concept, but some of the concepts, hey, maybe like a modern world. Except it's not a normal society, it's a fucking world where ev where the government is actually looking for power, or every single government, um, they're trying to find the power of the negative, the, the, the cursed negative dragon user, and the, the user will always be a man, uh, no matter what. And so how that works is... All right, so in the folklore, I, I, in that folklore, I'm sorry, in the uh, in the story that I'm currently working on, um, it goes like this. So after I said the cat, the dragon king curses him, but this is like way before civilization. So the dragons finally die, but before they were taken, before the drag, the baby dragon was taken, he cur dragon king cursed the man and his entire family bloodline of this negative dragon curse but what is the negative dragon curse if you ask it's basically dragon king's um uh think of your the best example i can really give and this is just a comparison is going to be final Fantasy 14's race falger and nidhogg those two are related and one one loved humans the other one hated humans negative dragon is an inspiration of nidhogg but the only difference is instead of being in a physical form it only has a spiritual form, but it can't do anything unless it possesses a body. Um, so there comes to that, of course. Um, that becomes a problem. So the negative dragon's like, I want to basically um, take over a human's body and destroy all the other humans. Obviously, down the line where nobody can figure out how we can do this or how, or, you know, how, how like basically... Now we figured out how to able to get rid of this curse from the family line, so that for the so the males keep dying. Oh, not the males, but like, but how it works is only one male can have it at a time in their and at their life at their lifetime. So the person, so basically, the answer is when you're born. Now, you become a normal baby like everybody else. As you start to get older, um, actually, what's funny is I was talking to somebody. And they're saying, like, well, if it's any ne ne negative emotion, you can easily get the power. I'm like, that's... Wait, that sounds kind of stupid. So, well, it could be anime... Well, like, well, you could do, like, anime logic, where... <laughs> I, I was like, well, I wanted to say, like, a negative emotion because... Or a traumatic experience, like, somebody... But the problem is that can also mean... Um... Like, lose a pet and dies, you, you get a negative emotion. If... But I'm like, wait a minute, I don't want it to be that easy. I want it to be very... I want it to be, like, somewhat... Not a too difficult one, but not too... But but not too easy, if you get... Not, not too easy, but not too hard either. Like, it's almost a little bit above average. So what I was trying to go with is... Now, the negative true dragon feeds off of negative emotions. We're talking about... Um, I can go sadness, revenge, despair... I can go any of those emotions. Those emotions work for, for his power. But the problem is, 
he feeds off of that person's negative feelings. He feeds off of that. And of course, when he grows in power, he can grow more control. And when he's in control of you, you start to lose your lifespan. Or your, li your lifespan. So, I'm not going to say equations, but you get my point. And he can take control of your body and basically destroy everybody. Will destroy all the human other beings, so it makes it looks like it's you, not the actual negative dragon itself. So, oh no, he's he's basically killing everybody. Um. So, but that's besides the point. Um. So, then I say, well, leave years down the line, uh, a woman who was a I would say she was like a priestess or a maiden of some sort. Um. She was blessed with gifted powers, already to begin with. Uh, down the line, she was helping her local shrine. And basically, a man comes up and prays. Or a man comes up and uh, prays that you know he'll be okay and whatever. But the problem was, um, by the time he got to that age, he already... Basically, how you can tell if you have the negative dragon's curse, if it's on your back. It'll be a, a symbol on your... It'll be symbol right around, like, maybe the back of your neck. Or not, look, not by, but like not on your neck. I'm sorry. Probably like right off right the top, the tip of your spine. It's a very tiny. It'll be like a very tiny, almost like a side of a button. Um, so you cover up with a shirt or whatever. Um, but the problem was he, everything around him becomes like they they are against him and they want him dead. Or the government basically wants to take control of his curse. His curse to take over other war to take over other countries or other places and put them under control basically use them as a weapon of any kind um until he dies but the thing was but anyways besides the point it's basically just like she helps him out and she got to know him as a person and he's why are you traveling around He's like, well, I don't want to have any attachments. Because I think also another thing that he says, like, do they have, does the character have to have an attachment to not, to make him feel why he's he travel? What is the reason? Why is he traveling? Then I'm like, oh shit, I didn't even think about that. Because he now has to run away from the government. He's being hunted down. Because the government wants him either dead or they want to use him. But anyways, besides the point, we got to that, and like I said, it was a very fun conversation. It was just like a line of text of mad people, and it was a lot of fun. So I, I hope you, I hope you find something. I'm like, thank you. So it was those three names I mentioned earlier. I, I, I like ear the most, but I, again, I want to do more research, more exploration. Uh, I am working working with you guys, um, working on the new art commission. It's the same exact character, um, and I haven't, I have an outfit kind of. I have an idea what the outfit is going to be, but the only problem is uh, I need it takes other characters' outfits or pieces of it and combining them to one outfit. If that makes sense. Um, but I'm gonna work on that. Uh, I'm working on that during the week. I haven't really came up with anything. That's why I haven't really made it yet. And um, so there's that, of course. Um, so anyways, uh, for today's game, we'll be playing Devil May Cry. Uh, I just figured we'd talk about here for a second just to um, elaborate a few things. So anyways, let me get started on DLC Devil May Cry. Here we go. All right. Let's, uh, let's, let's get ourselves a uh, wonderful deal here. All right, let me... Uh, all right, so we got our DLC Devil May Cry Definitive Edition, of course. Press options. All right, so we're going to play, the, obviously, Devil May Cry. I never even got to play this, so... New mission, secret buddy palace training. Yeah, we'll do a new game. All right, Devil Hunter and Ephilium. All right, uh... All 
All right, let's see what we got here. All right, we got here with a big black hole. I'm just joking. Yes, by close uh, trading cards. No, you can't have more time. You know the terms, you know the consequences. <laughs> no, this is not a veiled threat. This is a direct Okay, now what's this island? Should you fail to comply, the collapse of the economy will be on your head. I will make sure that you are stripped. And she got big tits. <laughs> I'm joking. I wouldn't. Is that clear enough to you? Friday it is then. You have a good night, Mr. President. Did you get it, my darling? Over a trillion. Oh. Soon I will own everything worth owning. I will control the world through debt. I have absolute power. <laughs> the world is at last a bitch. What's the matter? What? What's the matter? A loose end. A loose end? What? The son of Atreus' father, Dante. <laughs> what? Yeah. Him. <laughs> He's still out there. The hunters will find him. They found Sparta in his war. Yeah, okay. I <laughs> rip open his chest with my bare hands and feast his beating heart. What the fuck? I don't know who this old man is, but we'll figure out who he is later on. <clears throat> oh, it's angels! Oh, the angels! Oh, nightclub. Oh. Oh, is that some booty? Oh. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, now they're touching titty. Now they're touching a bunch of titties now. <laughs> Oh, look at this dude. He's getting all the blows. The son of Sparta. Whoa, 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 it looks like they're all making out over there. He's like, oh. That looks like such a shitty Dante. I hate that haircut.
I what? I saw a penis. You were careless. You left a trail. Now he's on to you. What are you talking about? Who's on to me? Behind your teeth. <gasps> he's here. All right, lady, do you realize you saw a man's penis, right? Bruh, he's butt ass naked with his pizza and is hanging on his winky. Missed. Oh, look at this piece of garbage. Let's go. Lesser Stygian. Come on. Oh my god, what is this? Slaying enemies through these white ways was down to his upgrade bar. Each time the bell fires on coverage, down to ability by upgrade shop. Is it Ebony and Ivory? No escape. Oh God, what is this? Ah! Target practice. Right on cue.
There we go. Gluttony's good. Okay. I'll die. I'm risking my life here for you. I want to help. I don't need your help. The hunter has dragged you into limbo. I can get you out. I've been down here before. I know how to get out. You fight whatever shit's up and drag you in here. You don't want to fight the hunter. He's not your regular demon. Follow me. Now. <clears throat> He's like, okay. Where'd she go? Lost soul. Souls trapped in limbo. Free them all to increase your mission completion bonus. Ooh, a key. There we go, right up there. God damn, I missed that trophy. Ooh, gold, gold orbs. Is that the save point? Off to got my coat back. Steve, I can't believe what I'm seeing. Let's get in there. Hey, 
Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I am the hunter demon. It's not he's in La Ball, but like. What is the secret key? There we go. What is this? Help. Collect four health fragments to create health cross. Ooh, okay, so we got a health cross out of that. Um Burr Breath? go okay so that's not the way to go where do I go from here God damn it.
Whoa, what the? My sh screen is shaking. Okay then. Let's fight. Dante. It's working. You can fight him. It won't be easy. The hunter. Evade. Jump over. Hey, what? How does that not work? But if you're calling me a son of a bitch, you wouldn't be the first. Oh. Back to the real world, the entire... Back there. 
I didn't ask for your help. Your microphone is off. You don't know. It's got this team punk like. Son of Sparta. Now it is just a matter of time. Oh, this guy looks pretty mug right there. Defeat Dante's pursuit. Let me, uh, let me turn this light on real quick. Give me one second. <clears throat> my brothers. My bucket man brothers. Yeah, no, that's a terrible human being. Very terrible human being. Um... Let's see, hold on, I'm trying to think we can upgrade. <clears throat> um... I mean, am I... Let's see, we got... I want, I kind of want new abilities, or new, just a new ability first. All right, so not the next mission. <clears throat> I just so bad when it's like you can't turn everything off and done it. Welcome to the order. I was expecting. That's the idea. The demons are amongst us, Dante. They are enslaving mankind. The world is asleep, brainwashed, helpless. We are a small handful of freedom fighters. We are the last and only line of defense. Defense? We have no chance. We don't leave things to chance. We've accumulated vast intelligence on the demons and their collaborators. World leaders, bankers, pop stars. We can hit them where it hurts. The hell?
Dante. If it really is you. You don't remember me. No. Oh, they'll flip How much of your childhood do you remember? Well, not much. I had meningitis when I was seven. Why my memory? Why? <laughs> They told me I had a car accident that resulted in total amnesia. Eight? You're welcome, my dear. Seven. Your point? Meningitis is a human affliction. You are not human, Dante. All war is fought with deception. You have been deceived. Your past has been hidden from you for a reason. Rewind a bit. Who are you again? My name is Virgil. I established the order to help find a way to fight the demons. That's your brother! but not the war. We use force, yes, but we also use intelligence, politics, propaganda. Do you really believe you can make it then? I'm actually going to focus on exploration, not the, um... With the two of us working together, I believe that we can defeat them. So that's what this is about. You need me to fight the demons, help you save the world. What else were you planning on doing with your life? You guys do seem really nice, but, uh, more of a loner type. Trust issues, work alone, that kind of thing. Dante, I don't think you understand what's at stake. If you want to leave, turn your back on me, I'm powerless to stop you. But you'll be making a grave mistake. Not just for yourself, but for mankind. For mankind? Yes! What makes you think I give a shit? Please give me a chance to show you. Show me what? Who you really are. He's like, the fuck? No. It's almost like the origin story. Ah, <laughs> uh, this one seems kind of shaky. Smell too good. It's in the can. Compound I with sea salt, shark oil, iron shavings, red potato squirrel semen, wolf hair. Good stuff. Ha! <laughs> squirrel semen? Oh. Hola, hello Spanish Sadie. Welcome, welcome. He doesn't seem to care. Yes, he doesn't care, Virgil, because he's a dumbass. I heard playing PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale and freaking see him as a character and he's not even that great on the, on the game like that. Why has he got the UK, like... <clears throat> All right, let me. I want to edit this honestly because I, I, I have to turn on subtitles. There you go. All right, let's keep moving now. Welcome, welcome. No, oh, I like Doritos. I'm a Virgil man. Virgil man. Secrets. As the cafe, I said I was just my bandana. What? I don't 
don't know what that means. I don't know anything. I'm in Walmart. I don't understand. I don't understand what that means. I'm an idiot. I remember this place. What coffee? This coffee is too hot for the room. Oh, wait a minute. Caliente means hot, right? I just realized Caliente is hot. Cafe, wait a minute. Is cafe coffee? Okay, cafe's coffee. Okay, well, I got a few words, but not entirely. I'm not, I'm being able to uh, speak another language. Your dad's a demon, your mom's a human. Oh my god. I just re I just realized I heard of Caliente. I just never heard him say it. Come on, it's mine! Let me come back to my dad! I feel like a child every time I do that. I never took any foreign languages. Yeah, I mean, how does that work? Yeah, I, I'm half demon, half human. <laughs> I'm, I'm full demon. <laughs> I loved your mother, so I created you and your brother. Ugh. Ah, uh, looks like he's humping, but never mind, that's a joke. Ugh. No, nothing ever sounds good. The Death Knight. You're up next. I think it sounds pretty awesome. I would love that. Oh, what the hell? So how do we hit him? No, it's not. It sounds pretty awesome, actually. You can stay up there. No, no, no. I just said the I bet I'm saying the mother and the father are half human, half demon. Wait, what are you talking about? Are you talking about the game or are you talking about something else? Oh, never mind. I'm an idiot. Of course, we're talking. I sound like an idiot every time. I mean, unless we're talking like I, I was actually. I mean, unless you're talking about the title. <laughs> talking about Dragon Woman's boobs the whole time. I mean, that sounds hot right now. Trying to show me. I mean, I just picture like just a couple of pieces of dragon scale like on her body and just her bobs hanging around. I was like, oh, right. Sparta. Yeah. Uh, hell yeah. The hell? Wait, is that supposed to be a scythe? Tita's. Gotta stay in the family. A acquire Akimitter. A demonic axe whose swing is slow but powerful. Armor is especially effective against shields. R2 triangle for armor attacks. That's a tough now. Oh, never mind. You're talking about boobs. I, I, that's probably boobs in English Spanish. I don't think I know what anything means in Spanish. I just know a few words. I definitely know Ola right there. I'm thinking Tita's boobs. Or titties. Some titties. I, 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 I'm I already looking like a moron. More and more of a moron. So you're doing a very good job of making me look like a moron. You're doing a very, very good job. <laughs> it's like, yeah, dude, this guy's a moron. Let's go. Let's keep going. I like this brain. Come back. Come back here, please. Ugh. Here you go. Here's your battle axe. Okay, I don't, I don't know. Wait, what the? 
It's highly effective against shields. Pet mouse. I don't want a pet mouse. I like, I, if I want a pet mouse, I want Tom and I want Jerry. I want Jerry. I want Jerry the mouse. Jerry's cool. I love Jerry. Jerry's so great. I love you, Jerry. Can you come back to me? All right, there we go. Here's that. Okay, here's your death knight. Get him out of here. All right, this is getting weirder and weirder. All right, come on. Where are we going now? <laughs> All right, let's see here. Um, I do not know what's going on besides bunch of boobs. I found a bunch of boobs in my brain. I think nothing of it. Ah! Oh. There we go. Ah! Oh. oh my God. They're all dead. They're all dead. Perfect. 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 Smash through the... Okay, so we have smash in the door. Whoa, this is like really fucking weird. Pizza's ready. Pizza! Perfect! Oh! Die! Let me show you my battle axe! The perfect pizza. I love me some pizza. Come on, pizza. Give me the pizza. Everyone likes pizza. I like Hawaiian pizza. Uh, I like pineapples on my pizza. This is getting fucking weird. <laughs> ham and pineapple. Of course, it's whole ham and pineapple. What the hell is going on? Where are we? Where am I going? That's a, that's a pretty weird statue. It looks like a Medusa man. Except there's no titties, just a rock. Uh. Ham and pineapple, I can go... Garden Alfredo pizza? Garden Alfredo! Meat lovers pizza, Veg the vegetarian pizza. <laughs> Am I dreaming? No. You're gonna call your dad. Wait, what? New ability unlocked. Orphan demon pole. Throw an Orphan whip to grapple enemies or objects to pull them towards Dante. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's very echoey, sir.
Come on, please, boys. I love this. Oh my god. I like Spanish. <laughs> the Spanish women don't like me. They punch me in the face constantly. They punch me till I just get destroyed. Here they come. They destroy me every day. R2 and square to pull enemies. Get over here. What are you, Scorpion? Get over here. Okay, come on. <sighs> come on. Oh. All right, give me one second. This is like, I don't know what's going on with the, uh, Yeah, um, I don't know what's making noise. I don't have anything that should be making noise. I don't know what it is. All right, you know what? We're good here. I like pineapples. <laughs> Women don't like anything. They uh, they don't like me especially. So I look like a pepperoni pizza, except it looks like shit. I love my pepperoni pizza. What now? What now? <clears throat> Ooh, what's this? You, sir. Okay. So what else have we got? Ooh, small vigil stars. Store a small portion of Dante's out during gameplay. Press options hit items use vital stars. Oh my God! Yay. Oh yeah, I forgot to like pull that out. What is going on? Shielded Bathos. Come on, there we go. God damn it.
Man, it's like oh, there we go. There you go. There you go, boys. Enjoy your uh, gunfire. What? They found you? Oh, God damn it. Fall off the fucking goddamn course. I like gods. I, li I like weirdos. <laughs> what kind of men do you like? I like weirdos. Let's see here. Is that mom? Um, I love you, Dante. Damn. Those fucking demons. God damn it. Now leave. You shall be extinguished from you. Looks like a scythe. Another scythe. It drives you crazy. I'll lock Akiris. New weapon unlocked. Uh, ground karma pop, prop air hanger rake. An angelic sight that particularly useful to deal with large crowds of enemies. Holy shit, what is this? Impressive. There we go. Slay a hundred deep hundred. You get after down there. Cover the doors. Move. Oh, yeah, we're good for a while. We're good. You mean it's non consensual? Uh, no, of course it is. There we go. There we go. Blue rose. Ooh, 
interesting. Yeah, why are we going back in this place again? You don't remember me. You don't remember me. You don't remember me. You don't remember me. My dear brother. Okay, let's keep going. All feel angel of throwing objects. Oh my god, I fell down. Nice. nice. All right, we'll keep it. Oh my god. There we go. Oh, there we go. I was like, what? I was almost going to get um live a live game. What am I on this show? Pro parry. Over draws a prop six with parrying. Come on, damn it. There we go. Remember 
Hey, this is me. I have a brother too. We were a family. I had no idea of the danger we were in. Oh my. Oh. When they broke in, I saw him. She gave her life so that we could escape. I will never forget what he did to her. us it is safely amongst the humans wiped our memories to protect us that's why it all went black until now thank you for the epic unit Shiva clearly I can't do this single player ah, I see probably like some sort of like There we go. Oh, I'm getting out of here. Keep going. There we go. You're my brother. Your twin brother. I've been looking for you for a long time now. Our mother gave these to us. She knew that this moment would come, that we would find each other. Now, Father, it's planned. Vanish forever. A fate worse than death, they say. He's never coming back. Where we come from, what happened to us. And above all, I want to know who's responsible for all this. So I'm a little quiet today. I'm just kind of like just I've been kind of like just sleepy not sleepy, but you know It's been a while since we played this so All right Let's see here, um, try to figure out like where I want to upgrade over here. That, that cat done it. Hello, Spirit Wolf. Welcome, 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 of course. Welcome, welcome. You're back from the blueberry of death. I like extra blueberries, please. I like my extra blueberries. Um...
Let's see. Um. Tons of blueberries. Yay! Blueberry emo boobs all day. Yeah, I'll take that. That's fine. Does she have big boobies? Must have the emo boobies. Well, I ain't getting nothing. I'll, uh... <clears throat> I had a weird, uh, person, uh... Uh, not Monday, uh... I think it was, I'm trying to think. Yeah, it was Sunday. Mm -hmm. I had to deal with the weird... I had to deal with... Not weird, but, um... Like, I was talking to a woman, I guess, and, uh... It was, it was just literally just yesterday and... Not yesterday, um... Sunday and Monday. Hey, hey, hey don't worry, I've, uh... I said no, so... I said no! Ooh. Do you remember this place? Yeah, I remember coming here. Mother used to bring us here. Tell me everything. Some things have always been. There have always been angels. There have always been demons. And there have always been a Oh, um, so... Nine millennia ago, one demon broke the <coughs> Mundus did not rise alone. At his right hand was his most trusted lieutenant, his blood brother, Sparta. Well, I think, okay, uh, I'll. Traitor. He fell in love with an angel, Eba. I'll tell you guys the story. So, once once we uh, get out of this damn cutscene, though, I'll definitely tell you the, the funny. Uh, I'm not gonna pick on the person. Though. I'm not picking on them. Just kind of just shows. I just don't. I just said no. Like. Mundus learned of Sparta's betrayal, his fury knew no limit. He hunted the lovers down. Eva was murdered by his own hand. And for Sparta, he demanded a more brutal fate. Endless punishment and pain. What the fuck? But even as Eva was destroyed, and Sparta was in prison for eternity. Each knew that the seed for their revenge had already been sown. Because according to legend, the only beings that can slay a demon king are Nephilim hybrid of angel and demon those hybrids now exist you and I hybrids all right well can we I guess cutscene now I, I blueberry wants to hear the story Mundus believed that only one child you know what? screw it I'll tell right now all right so I get like a me I, I messed with somebody yesterday and I try to like I literally I was talking to them I literally stated that I wanted to have I wanted friends um, and to somebody to talk to. No, now I'm looking for a relationship, none of that shit. So finally, I get a text and I get a phone and then like whatever. Uh, then she's like, "Do you prefer talking on the phone?" So I did. Okay, so I talked on the phone, and the problem was not like wanted to be. I wanted to be talked to somebody first to get to know them. And of course, like with anybody, you can't just go to anybody you want. Like, you just have to get to know the person before you decide, you know? So, we were talking for a while, and then, like, the first thing was she basically just... She tells me a little about herself, and then she, then she says, um... Like, are you okay with I'm like, uh, what are you gonna say? So I was not sure what she was gonna say. Then she says this, uh, I'm a very, uh, sexual person. I'm like, um, okay. Do you feel the same? I'm like, uh, mm. I'm like, I, I, 
I don't want <laughs> in my head. I'm like, why would you ask me that the first thing? I don't understand Cole. I don't understand our society. I really fucking don't. <laughs> so after like I gave like another chance, just cause, I don't know. People are fucking weird sometimes. So and then she's like, well, and then at the end, like I kind of said, like, well, I'm not looking for a relationship. And then she is. I'm like, yeah, this ain't going to work. And second, um, like, I'm not trying to be mean and I respect people for this. Like, you got to take care of your own stuff. Take care of your own things. And, you know, I have priorities. So she wanted a relationship and I said, no, <laughs> It does, it's only been like not even less than 48 hours because I wanted I wanted somebody like not a companion not just more than just a not what I'm trying to say is um I didn't want like what society wanted you know what I mean like the whole um fast food relationship bullshit I wanted like the longevity of that I mean, not where like everybody's like 16 years old and keep talking to each other. Not that way, but you know, just whatever. I just said, no, I'm like, yeah, I'm not interested. Um, I hope you have, I hope, I hope you find somebody you wanted Bye. And then it was, it was, it was fine. But like, it just got fucking weird. She probably wasn't happy, but, but the truth is like, that was too fast for me. That was way too fucking fast. I'm like, first of all, <laughs> She was probably pissed and I, I, I'm like, I don't care. I'm like, I'm not gonna like. And then one day then she's asked me, oh, are you like a <laughs> she asked me if I was a fuck if I ever had sex before? I, and I'm like, no. <laughs> or, or asked me about my past relationships and all this other shit. And I'm like, um, <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. This is not a good I, I don't know. Just just I, I said to myself, I'm like, look. You know, when I when something happens between a relationship, I'm not going to like bash on the person I was. With. I'm not going to do that. I, I just say, like, it just didn't work out and there were different. It's OK, like you said, uh, feeling very lonely. Yeah, she did tell me that she was lonely and uh, there was some other details. It's just just there was other things that I didn't that I don't think she would have understand it anyways. So respect to that, of course. It's just like I said no because I wanted to. I was not in a good, in my opinion, right now. I'm this. I'm not the situation I'm in right now is not going to help, like for both parties, or for her either. Like if both parties were like in a good place, and then it could happen, but because we're not, or one of the other, I don't think it's going to work. So I understand, like, she, I, I heard her story and I understand it, most of it or some of it, you know. Uh, there are other things that I can't understand either. I'm not trying to mean it. I'm like, well, I, I don't know what else to tell you. Like, I, I'm like, I, I, I didn't say I was doing I never even said any of this before. It, it's just that, like, I think, honestly, like, they want, I say you're better off with somebody else because I was not looking for a relationship. I just wasn't like I don't understand why taking the time to get to know somebody is very hard on society. I don't understand that. How how is that hard? I, I understand that takes time. But once again, that's the point. They also have to do the same thing. You are you have to put in work just like I am. I got to put work. You got to put work in everything. I don't care. Nobody wants to do time. Everybody want everything's fast food. So right there, it was like, well, I could teach like then, then she, when I mentioned like sex or whatever, I mentioned, but she mentions it. She mentions it first. Not even me. I didn't even say anything about it. I'm like, well, first of all, I don't feel comfortable with that because I don't know you. So I'm not going to just like take my memory card and shove it to a different goddamn system. <laughs> I am not going to do that. Like me, uh, maybe like for me, like honestly, it's it's more of just like it's. I, I guess my V car is precious. I guess, you know, or whatever. You know, I'm like, look, I'm not gonna like. 
I'm not doing it. I'm like, no, just. And then mentions like the the phone thing. I'm like, phone sex. I'm like, I don't even. I haven't. We. I'm like, I don't even got to know you, and I don't even got to that part of. The, I'm like, no, it's gotta take time. There's steps for that. I'm sorry. You're. Tr I feel like in a way you're trying to skip that, and I don't. And I don't want that. I don't want to skip that. Like, what's wrong with me trying to get to know somebody and and determine if I should be with that person or not? What's wrong with that? You know? Nothing wrong with that. And I said no. I was like, no, I don't. That's why I, I put it down in the description. I want friends only. Well, friends and chatting, and that's it. I don't want like anything further than that. I don't want to be used as a freaking like uh, I don't know, um, a ATM. No thanks. So I just said no. And I'm not gonna speak to that person ever again. Style rank system registers how stylish you fight. Each action before generates style point P in the same action, which over time reduces its value. Her bonus for style trees are just killing him without taking damage, parrying, aerial long combos, and more. It, it's just I don't know. I, I didn't want to do it, so I don't care. So I'm like, you know what? Like I, I if I'm being an asshole, I, I mean, here's the thing. No, I I hope to like she I, I I hope as well like she finds somebody she wants. I I'm hoping she does because honestly there was no synergy, nothing. I, I felt like there was nothing. There. I'm not blaming her, but like I, I said I wanted did want a relationship, just wasn't ready for one. I didn't want to. I, I hope she's okay too. I hope she finds somebody. There's ton there's tons of people in this world. There's tons of people. Like I try to be not I, I I want to be as nice as possible, but I, I I have my own preferences too. Like not selfish preferences, but there's there's reasons, you know. I just don't I just don't like the concept of the fast food relationship process. I hate that shit. Like, if I like somebody, then I will try to go, and you know, then I go for it. But, like, when I feel like I'm being, like, or just, like, the adrenaline or what, no. I don't do that shit. There's tons, there's tons of way more people. But you know what? It's okay. Yeah, okay, that's just how I am. And I'm not gonna change that. She'll be fine. But anyways, let's go. Um, but anyway, that's that's kind of the story. It was it was only for like less than forty eight hours of just phone conversation and like, um, she, I I, felt I had to carry most of the conversation, so there was no like. Again, synergy is always key for me, and there was nothing. So. Can you get a I'll have to find another way. What the hell? Am I going for this? But, you know, I, I hope people are. I hope she's okay, too. Once again, I hope she's okay. I think she'll be fine. It's just... I had to say no. I'm like, no. I know, I'm just... I have my own... I have my own problems to deal with, and I'm not going to share it. Uh, hold on. I, I once told somebody now and I've regretted it over since she had a huge crush on me and I told her no what a mistake and what a mistake that was you know what it's I, I understand what you're saying but I'm not just gonna go for like the thing is I'm not gonna be I don't I don't want to sound desperate that's the problem and that situation to me looked like, was kind of desperation and the and also again i don't like the concept of the fast food relationship crap but i rather meet i rather actually talk to somebody like over oh, like at like a like a public place and get to know the person and of course like both both parties determine like do i like this guy or do i like this chick like you know whatever it, it, it's just it was very it felt very one-sided and 
like you can't just like somebody within like less than 40 hours that that sounds fucking ridiculous it's stupid so i didn't have anything to kind of like i didn't have like an attack i didn't have like a you know i mean i just i wanted to talk to him just to have like a conversation like get to know somebody get to know people but uh, no, I don't know why they, she took it as I want a relationship. I'm like, no, that's not what I wanted, but uh, okay. Like, I can't do that. I, I can't do that. I gotta start, like, it's not just looking out for myself. It's more like what's best for our, it's what's best for both parties. And I think this is best for both parties. Oh, I see. That's crazy. See, that's it's just that's what we're gonna live with. And you know what? I think it's you know I think it's you know I'm not saying I think it's fine, but it's just you know people have circumstances, and I think it's just not everybody's gonna understand what I what um how I am. I may sound like a fucking weirdo, and probably uh, I don't know just a fantasized weirder or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care at this point. So, I mean, I'm happy. I have to be, I, I understand too. Like I also have to be comfortable alone. And right now I was not, I, I was kind of also as well as I was in kind of a situ, um, I guess I just wasn't in the best of mind. You know, I just like, yeah, I don't think this is going to work. And I have my reasons. It's like, I want to improve myself. That's all. So if I, I wouldn't see I, I but the thing is but the thing is too blueberry if you think about it is she also she probably also moved on. So the, you probably did lose your second chance. That's another thing. I mean for me will I get a second no I'm not going to get a second chance like no of course not. I know that. I don't know I don't see I don't know that. I'm saying some people I'm just saying like for myself I'm not going to get a second chance. She could have moved on. It could have been, you know, a ton of things. I can't find where the hell I'm supposed to go from here. I don't know. Where am I supposed to go? No, no, no. I'm saying, like, I'm not saying she is still single, but, like, she moved on from, your, from the crush, I'm saying. I'm saying she probably moved on from that. And she accepted it. You know, like, oh, well, she said, no, that's her mind, you know? I can't speak for everybody, but, you know, that, that's just kind of like you have to understand somebody else's perspective. Like, well, maybe, uh, maybe I should move on. It's all just a matter of, like, perspective, and not everybody can see that. Well, I, I don't know what else to tell you. I don't know. Do what you Do what you think is best for yourself, you know? Not, in, not entirely selfish, but, like, you know, what you want. And that's what matters, you know? I'm not going to say go cheat or anything. I'm not saying that. You know, do do whatever. I mean, for me, for me on my situation, it was just a matter of, like, there, there's no way it was going to work. This is already going too fast. I'm like, no. I wanted, I wanted almost like, a, you know, a plant just grow and grow over time. Where the hell is this? Where am I supposed to go from here? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh. I was supposed to be in here? Okay. Like, for me, like, I'm an ugly dude and I don't care. Like, okay, great. I don't give a shit. I gotta love myself first. To get my drift. Though, it would be me if I give up my two emo girlfriends to be with her. I, mean, have a, I also have a crush on her. Well, I wouldn't just... I wouldn't do that. Like, dump them just for that, you know? I'd say it's time, you know. For some people, it's hard to move on. For some people, it's very hard. Don't cheat. <laughs> Just don't. Be loyal. Be yourself and be honest. You get through, you get through like a lot. You get through a lot more.
She's fucked up. I mean, that's that's common sense, of course, but. All right, come on. Dragon mouth, dragon woman's boobs. I wonder. I wonder what a dragon. I kind of want to know what dragon boobs kind of look like. Well, they have like nice hard scales. The thing is that they. I know I have a crush on her, and I do love that girl, and they know it. She's, I don't. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know. See, I don't know. See, I don't know anything because I'm not. Like, I'm not. I'm not currently in a relationship right now. Yeah, I don't think I ever want to be unless like somebody sees me for who I am. God damn it. Uh, it's got it's like you got a reverse ha you got harem situation over there and harems don't work either they never do i think everybody knows that what the hell how do you get over there Controls are fucking weird too. I mean, but anyways, it's it's. Do what you want to goddamn do. That's all I can really say right now. That is loyalty that my crush is waiting for me. I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. I mean, I wouldn't call it royalty. I don't know about that. It's just I, I don't I don't see I don't understand human nature. Humans are very, very hard to understand. I wish I understand too, but I don't. I don't like I mean as a guy, I don't have there's no way women have crushes on me. There's no fucking way. Like, that'll be rare if, like, one girl has a crush on me. That'll be fucking rare. And they know me for a long time. That's different. See, I don't know what... I don't know what I would do either. Oh, there we go. Only kind of gift worth giving. Acquire the angel boost ability. Okay, well, it's Angel Boost. I mean, Oh my god. No, what the fudge? Oh, I used it. I had to use that first. Never mind. Oh my god. No. Not really. I'm not getting a hang of that. Okay. Oh my god! 
Controls are so fucking weird. Alright. Alright, see, I, I wouldn't know what to do with myself, honestly, if I was in that situation. I just... I, I need to, like... Because, honestly, for me, I want to make sure that the person that I want to be with actually does what... Not what they're supposed to do, but, like, what, what I... Not what I want them to do either, but, like, just... Be, like, a decent person or have, like, understanding of my mindset and knows me too well. That would... That is something I would want. But that's about it. And understands that... Understands who I am. I'm not saying... Like, yeah, there will be some doubts of cheating or whatever. That's going to happen. But most of the time, they'll be loyal. Most of the time. And, I'll, and I'm going to do... I always and I do the same for myself. Just giving away, like... Like, even just when she used my V-card to somebody I don't even know. I'm like, yeah, no. That already make me sound like a simp. So, I just did what not a simp can't do. I didn't want to be a simp. Yeah, honestly, I'm, I'm kind of like also almost passing out too on my end. I'm just a little bit sleepy. I'm going to call it a... I want to call it a night tonight, actually, honestly, after this mission. I will, I'll be on back tomorrow. I'll make up for it. I mean, right now, I'm just like, uh. I didn't do a lot today, but, like, honestly, I did a lot of, like, just search, soul searching for a new character name for what I'm making right now, and it's just not, it does say it's not fun, but. God damn it. Blueberry soup. Wait, what about blueberry soup? God damn it. I'm like not used to this game. Come on, game. Wow. There we go. Cat, on my way. All right, let me try to let me let me right, let me get up there and try to get that uh, vital star that's in the corner. Oh, you know, I sp okay, I know what I'm supposed to do now. Yeah, I got the vital star now. Well, hybrid's actually pretty cool, honestly. Silver Sachs Tower, the world's most powerful investment bank. You know who runs it? CEO Kyle Ryder, a human vessel, a physical manifestation of money. Through death, he controls everything. For Mundus, the world is a factory farm for human souls. And he likes to keep his animals monitored and docile. 
The monitoring is done by the Raptor News Corporation, a global network of CCTV cameras, satellites, and spies. The way he keeps us docile is uh, a little more insidious. What is it? It's in your hand. Planet Earth's most popular soft drink, virility. The beast is spiked. Ah, it's okay. It has no effect on us, only humans. It's phlebotomy in a can. So what's the plan? That's the Hellgate. A conduit from which Mundus draws his power. While he's connected to the Hellgate, he's immortal. But we get him away from the Hellgate, and our swords will do the rest. So how did we do that? We get his attention. Mundus is petty. He's impulsive. If we hit him where it hurts, let his anger rule him, I believe we can draw him out. Okay, so to kill Mundus, we need to drag him away from the Hellgate. We do that by pissing him off. Roughly speaking, yes. And we piss him off by taking out the Raptor News Network and Virillin. That's it. What? Which one do you want to do first? Okay. All right. We're gonna like not get off the game, but we're gonna get off the game and we're gonna do just chatting because. Like I said, uh, I'll, I'll show you guys something too. I got, I got a cool couple cool things I'll show you guys. Mission. Alright. Let's uh, switch games real quick. Hold on. Oh, we'll switch to webcam. There you go. I, I, I didn't really... Uh, ice. Not ice. Um... Mission four. We don't need to deal with that right now. All right. All right. So I got some. I got some cool things for you guys. So hold on. Let me get up here and no ice. What do you mean no ice? I don't want you mean. This. There's a. Uh... I don't have any ice on me. The hell. All right. So I end up uh, looking on Amazon and I'm looking for a game. Uh, in particular, uh, I couldn't get the um, at the. I couldn't get the freaking. The cover for it so here you guys go go get some ice ice for what like ice for my back ice on my on my uh, down my i don't know where do you want me to go to put the ice <laughs> I don't know. so anyways so if you guys didn't know if you guys couldn't read i understand so i got so i basically i got chrono trigger a uh, glass of ice yeah, no thanks. I don't think I want to get a glass of ice. So I ended up getting um, Chrono Trigger uh, for the DS. I couldn't get a, a hands on a physical one, so I put it on uh, my Final Fantasy uh, Echoes of Time uh, DS game case. So, because I've heard that Chrono, Chrono Trigger is such a really good legendary game, I was going to play that later, probably on my off time. But I'm not really in a rush for it because I don't personally care not personally care but i just have to have the game and i'll, I'll have games for days I'll have, I'll have games for days um so for right now it's only a matter of like i don't know i mean I, i'll have to see though because this is gonna be cool uh go to the kitchen no i'm not going to the kitchen right now to go get a glass of ice putting it i don't know somewhere what you want me? Want me to put this in ice? Cause uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm not going. I'm not going in the kitchen right now. Oh, take me to the kitchen. No, I mean, first of all, I'm connected to the camera, so no. No. What do you want me to do? With the glass uh, thing of ice. Um, excuse me, but I, <laughs> I'm not getting ice. Go get, get me some ice. I'm not getting ice. That's the point. I'm not going to get ice. I mean, but anyways, um, so I'm going to continue playing DMC Devil May Cry uh, probably just the whole time because I, I figure I'd take a little break because it's funny. I've been I'm not gaming all day, but just 
Uh, there's also a new Final Fantasy XIV event that's still continuing on, and uh, we get all kinds of items. I've actually been doing that for hours, and I've noticed that that's also draining the shit out of my out of my gaming time. So I'm like, oh shit, I, I usually game like later. I don't know if anybody's known, but like The Last of Us Part One, like remaster, doesn't. No, it doesn't look that great. Nothing's changed, and the game's been out since 2013. A 10 year old game, and it's it's already been remastered on the PlayStation 4. Now it's gonna be what remastered again in freaking uh PlayStation 5. Like you could have just like you know what they could have done is they could have you know used the uh, the engine not the engine the I mean they could have just put in on the like a like enhanced version on the on the if on the PS4 to PS5 you can upgrade it and I, I'm not gonna do that and it's it's stupid I'm like I already got the game for free on PlayStation Plus so who cares. Uh, but besides the point, um, I gotta play God of War at some point. The 2018 God of War, I really need to start playing that because the new Ragnarok's actually coming out um, in August. Actually, not August, uh, November 9th, which will be uh, pretty fascinating. Um, and second, um, I gotta, I have to, um, I gotta be, I gotta be focused on that. So, anyways. I would call it a night tonight. I know it's 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 fucking short. Tell me about it. It's mad short and it's it's dumb. Like yeah, um, what's going on? I'm like, well, I need to probably. Uh, I was thinking I might get a break. I don't I'm just like just tired of gaming in general. Like, not now, but who the fuck knows? Um. So, anyways, um, but yeah, I can probably. I might end up just doing like a little bit of a podcast episode every once in a while. We can have some fun there. Um, we're gonna call it here uh, once again. So I'll be playing this. Uh, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I wanna do one more live stream. I, I, I don't see. I don't know if I wanna do tomorrow, but I don't think I want to. I think I'll save it for Friday when I'm actually um, feeling not feeling a lot better, but I'm actually feeling more confident. Uh, not confident. I just like just not really. I'm kind of out of it right now, honestly. So it's just uh, I'm gonna need some time to kind of like just. <clears throat> I'll, I'll i'll be back on the groove so but anyways thank you guys so much uh thank you um spirit will fire tail blueberry of course thank you for stopping in and spanish sadie for stopping in and teaching me a little bit of spanish even i don't know anything about it so now i know that uh caliente's coffee and cafe obviously is co is freaking coffee well actually i i kind of knew cafe is like a coffee place but i didn't know that's what's translated to uh, but anyways, thank you guys so much. Uh, we'll be raiding uh, Miltendo. Uh, and we're to call it here. But anyways, thank you guys so much. Hope you guys have a fantastic rest of the night. I love you. I love you guys. All of yous. Uh, and we will uh, we'll talk again uh, pretty soon. Anyways, guys, love you all. Peace out.